I'm awesome at a lot of things. One thing I'm not awesome at? Video games. Until now, this is Girlfriend Versus. <laughs> what are we doing? Girlfriend versus Thanksgiving special! <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving and today we thought we would give thanks to some other YouTubers who have been absolutely wonderful and sent us some games to play. Right now we are going to play all of the games that we have been given by other YouTubers. Because we like showing thanks to you guys. Interesting fact, mm -hmm. I have not played a single one of these games. Really? So, coaching you today, mind. I can't. The challenge today wasn't really a challenge because um, Boyfriend had never played any of these games, so therefore it was very difficult to set up a challenge. Yeah, we could rate them. Yeah, we'll rate yeah. them. The, there's a challenge. Girlfriend's got to rate the games. <laughs> Will like she be it. able to do it? <laughs> <laughs> First game we played comes all the way from the YouTube channel Game vs. Game. Eric, he gave us Dr. Mario. Dr. Mario 64 from Game vs. Game. Dr. Mario 64. I've actually never played this, and I believe it's our first puzzle game. You mm -hmm. haven't played a puzzle game, right? No, we haven't. And Dr. Mario, you uh, have these little pills and each side is a different colour, so it's a bit like a Tetris kind of game. I played Tetris. Good. Then you should be a pro at this. <laughs> and the idea is to uh, line up all the colours in different um, formations, you can flip them and everything, and get rid of the viruses. Yep, good. No, yeah, what? that's good. Flip it. Oh. Oh, there's a yellow and red one right there. Red. Oh, you missed it now. Oh my oh, gosh, you're not doing too good. This is really hard, actually. Good job I'm not a doctor. Oops. Oh no! Here we go. Girlfriend was not good at Dr. Mario. Nope, the other way. What? The red's on the other well, side. I don't Why know. did you go over the yellow? Stop shouting! The problem with Dr. Mario is the pills were coming too fast that I couldn't coach a girlfriend on how to flip them and set them in the right way. So by the time that I would like get a coherent thought in my head that I could turn into a sentence to tell girlfriend, the pill was already dropped in the wrong spot. Oops. Why? Oops. Why would you go over the yellow? I panicked. The yellow. I panicked. I wasn't very good at turning the pills and putting them in the right place. Oh no. I felt like you had a plan there. Oh, I did. Didn't, but then it didn't, didn't come together. No. There was a couple of times where I got really excited that I was going to do it right, and of course I didn't do it right. Oh no! Yeah. I was doing kind of well for a second there. Hang on, let me do it again. I kept saying, "Let's have another go." Let's have another go. I really wanted to get good at it. I wanted to keep having more and more goes. Oh no! <sighs> Girlfriend loved Dr. Mario. I, I was getting really frustrated and she was just loving it. She loved playing it. I'm like really bad at this. <laughs> I'd probably be just as bad. No, you couldn't possibly be. Nah, yeah, you're probably right. I love this game and I'm really looking forward to playing it again. So thank you Game vs. Game for this wonderfully addictive game. Oh! <laughs> like every time you're... it flips the wrong way! You're really good at doing the thing you shouldn't do. I know! <gasps> I don't even know how that happened! You know what? Let's just quit while oh. we're ahead. <laughs> you won? I don't know how it happened. I guess Wario just sucked. Let's just, let's just call it a day, huh? He potted the black. And then pointed the white. That's what he did. <laughs> All Yay! Right. I was doing okay though. Well, not really. So rating, we decided to rate these games and we're going to say should we play it or should we skip it? And I would say play it. Play it! Here we are playing the Dreamcast. You have not played the Dreamcast on Girlfriend Versus. No. No, I haven't. And we've got Floygan Brothers. Loigan Brothers from the Dreamcastic Channel. 
So then we played the Floygan Brothers, and that was from the Dreamcastic channel, and it was PC Wizard 13. So thank you very much for this game. I guess we go to... Let's just go to game. Okay. I don't even know how to describe Floygan Brothers. I don't... I couldn't even place a genre on this game. What were you supposed to do? What's that over there? You were in a farm or something? And there was like obstacles everywhere. All right, so I need the key to get in there. To there. It's kind of point and click. It's kind of 3D platformer. It's kind of puzzle game. It's all sorts of genres mixed into one. What about that, uh... Wait, is that a key up there? Yes, there is. And that is a Can you like pot. throw that? And we just didn't really know what we were doing. At one point, I picked up a plant pot to try and get a key. And I said to boyfriend, what should I do? And he said, throw it. Throw! Well, that didn't work. <laughs> I just threw, threw that up You just threw there. the plant up there. And then the plant pot got stuck on this really high ledge. And we needed the plant pot later. How am I going to get that plant? You should have thrown it up there. You told me to throw it! You did it! Babe. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't know what we were doing in this game. I just don't feel like I'm very good at this game. I don't, I'm getting a little bit frustrated. Me too. What is there to say about this game? We ran around trying to figure out what you're supposed to do, and there's no indication what you're supposed to do. You just had to throw that thing up there, didn't you? You told me, throw it up there. So and I'm you listened. How many times? Hey! Yes! I think this was a long game. You needed to play this for a very long time. This wasn't something you could dip in and out of. Oh my goodness. Now go plant that stupid thing. I don't think I've played a game that long and accomplished so little. Take this, brother. May it serve you well. Let's do something else. Cancel. Drop. So after all of that... Nothing. I said to boyfriend at the beginning, should we do the tutorial? And he said, no, 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 let's just get on with the game. Let's just go to game. Okay. Next time? Maybe we should have played the tutorial at the beginning. <laughs> if I was going to say to play it or skip it, I would actually say play it. I really like this game, and I think that once we knew the rules, it would be really good. Play it! So then we played DK's Freak Out? No, what was it called? <laughs> Donkey Kong Bongos. Donkey Kong Jungle Beat from Luigi Freak Out 1, 2, 3. You want to know the controller? Yes. <laughs> awesome. So Donkey Kong Jungle Beats was sent to us from Luigi Freakout123. Terry and Tyler. Keep hitting it. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, I see. Boy, you guys sent the right game. Girlfriend loved this game. Wait, hey, good lord! Just hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's just figure this out. Come on! If you don't like going to the gym and you just want a bit of a workout, this is the game for you. <laughs> Do you even know what you're doing? You're just, this is the equivalent of button mashing, but with <laughs> drums. Rhythmical button mashing. Good God. She was banging that drum like I ain't never seen someone bang a drum before. <laughs> and there was clapping and there was smacking and it was so fun. Wow. That's good, that's fun. Well, <laughs> my hands are up here, this is fun. Are you liking it? Yeah, let's do the next bit. Oh, yay. It was very exciting, and for a moment, if you just took a breather, something would happen and it would be telling you, clap, clap, smack, smack. It was really fun, this was really fun. <laughs> The funny thing was, I didn't even know if she knew what she was doing. Uh, amazingly, she was 
beating the levels. <laughs> but to me, it just looked like some crazy person banging this drum. Come on! I think that was probably her favorite game that we played today was Donkey Kong's Jungle Beats, and I wouldn't be surprised if she whips that out another time and starts playing it. She couldn't get enough of that game. You can stop, you can stop, you can stop. <laughs> I had to put my hands in the freezer after we had played. Look at my hands, they're red. You went to town on this red bongo drums. Why don't we say? Yeah, fry an egg on them. <laughs> that was fun! Play it or skip it, play it. Play it, play it, play it, play it, play it. Thank you so much, Terry and Tyler, Luigi Freakout123. Awesome. Play it! This game disc could not be read. <laughs> Let's try again. All right. Adam Long, U S O B. Remember yes. the movie, the film, Bad Boys. Bad Boys, Bad Boys. What, what you gonna, gonna do? do? What, what you gonna, gonna do when they come for you, you Bad Boys? Shy guy, shy guy. Do you remember that one? Nope. That was from Bad Boys. Mercy, mercy, mercy. Oh yeah. Party, party, party. Bad, Bad Boys, boys. Miami, Miami takedown, takedown from, from Adam Long. So Adam sends us Bad Boys, Miami Takedown. I think this is probably the worst game we've played so far in Girlfriend Versus. And we played Gremlins 2 for the Game Boy. Can you look around and aim? Because you have that, see how you have the aiming thing? Where's look, the aiming thing? In the center of the screen. You see the little Oh cross, yeah, I didn't see that before. Crosshairs. I was not very good at Bad Boys, Miami Takedown. Uh, I found the controls very difficult to use. This is very difficult. It's the first time you've had to use like the yeah. analog to look around. Okay. I don't know where I'm shooting. What was shoot again? There's so many buttons. I played Will Smith in this game. Um, and you kind of went round hiding behind things and trying to shoot people who were shooting at you. I think those are like you stand and then you like peek inside the doorway to like look for people. So maybe like press B. There you go. We spent 15 minutes trying to shoot one bad guy in a bathroom. Did you... Oh, shoot, shoot. Oh, he's, you gotta I aim at it. I don't know how to do you it. You gotta aim with this, aim, ah! aim with the C stick. She's standing around the corner, trying to look into the bathroom to shoot the guy. I got shot! So you gotta look back in, and then you're gonna have to use your trigger shoot. finger to shoot him. But you gotta aim at him, okay? Ah! Aim at him! Aim at him! Can you imagine this happening in real life? So, you're a bad guy, standing in the bathroom, and you know a cop's right outside the door. This guy keeps poking his head in, looking at the ceiling, looking at the floor, popping out. Over this way, over this way. Shoot. Yep. Shoot, go up, over, over, shoot. And I didn't know how to coach her. I'd never played this game before. So I'm trying to tell her, well, look up, look down. Look up, look up, look up. I can't. Yes, you can, look up. You gotta use these. Oh, but down it's is up inverted. and up is oh. down. Hold on. I don't like that. That's why I was looking up, but it was wrong. Invert. Eventually, we figured out that the controls were inverted. So that helped a little bit when I switched the controls to just regular. Where'd he he's go? Gone. Oh, he's oh. there. Is that really him? Go in there. I can't. Go in there, bust the door down. I don't know how to get in B, there. B, B. Alright, I'll walk in there. Is he? How'd you get in the door? Well, first of all, look down because you're looking like. Oh, oh wait, turn around! Turn around! There he is. I shot him. You killed the guy! Holy crap, finally! <laughs> Alright, press. Okay. <laughs> we didn't get very far in this game. I'm surprised you haven't died yet. 
<laughs> Partly because girlfriend could barely grasp the controls. But the other thing is, it's just a bad game. It's, it's not very well made, and nothing against Will Smith and Martin Lawrence. Love those guys. But uh, this game was terrible. Oh, my Lawrence. Oh, wow, how are you not dead? Look at your friggin' health. Oh, he might kill you. He did. I died. Oh, wow. You made it pretty far, though. You know, I think we had more fun just singing Will Smith songs. Started making trouble in my neighborhood. I got in one little fight, my mom got scared. Instead of moving with your auntie and I got in the land. Boom, shake, shake, shake the room. Boom, shake, shake, shake the room. Tick, 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 boom. We can make it if we try, just the two of us. You and I. So thank you, Adam Long, for making us play that turd. Play it or skip it. Skip it. Skip it. Super Back to the Future 2 from the Nintendo Doctor. So thank you very much, the Nintendo Doctor, otherwise known as Doc NES, for Super Back to the Future 2. We've played two Back to the Future games this season. Can you believe it? Okay, so I'm you're on Marty on your hoverboard. This was the first reproduction that I've ever played. Apparently this game only came out in... Japan, I think it was. Uh, okay, so it's kind of like, would you call this a platform game? Yeah, this would be a platform. And Girlfriend did great. I mean, she was flying through. She's on the hoverboard. She's being Marty. Cool. All right. Oh. You beat the first level. <laughs> Pretty sweet. I even got to Cafe 80s, and I had to have a fight with Griff. Boss. Yeah. No, that's the password. I know, it's boss. You're fighting Griff. Oh dear. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, probably maybe not want to do that. Or maybe you do. Oh, he got him. Did you get him? No way. You freaking beat him. <laughs> she gets to Griff for the boss battle. Beats him lickety split. Yo, Bozo! I'm going to work on water unless you have power. She gets to level two, and she gets to this segment where you're supposed to jump on top of these flying cars. Uh-oh. Gotta use the flying cars to get up. Oh, no. Yeah. Gotta do some platforming. Suddenly, we come to a grinding halt. Girlfriend just cannot get this jumping from car to car down. No, 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 no. You, you, okay, when you get on the blue car, scoot as far to the left as you can so you can get a running jump. Got it? No. The cars were um, possibly one of the hardest things I have come up against in any video game I've played so far. There! Yes! Do that! That's exactly Shh, right. Don't shout. No, no, you got on the freaking red I didn't touch it! Because you got to jump! I was getting so frustrated. I don't think I've been this frustrated in any girlfriend versus. I was legitimately angry at a certain point. <laughs> uh. <laughs> You're making it harder than it needs to be. We must have been 15 minutes jumping from one car to the next car. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> I can't take it much more. Oh no, these are on the same thing. Oh. Come on, come on. I know a lot of people hate Back to the Future for the NES. If I'm going to compare this game to that game, this game was easier to play um, up until the cars. But I actually enjoyed the other Back to the Future better. Ooh! Okay, when it, do you see when it's going down like that? You gotta run, go, yes! Yes! Okay, now you just gotta get over there. So you gotta get a run and jump. Oh! <laughs> Frickin' finally! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> so, am I going to play it 
or skip it? I'm gonna skip it. Skip it! I feel so bad because people gave us these games! But thank you so much for giving it to us. I'm really happy for the experience. So we've come to the end and we'd like to say Happy Thanksgiving! Yay! <laughs> it's such a nice holiday. It is. Nobody yeah. does Thanksgiving videos. We're doing a Thanksgiving video. Yeah, we're giving thanks and thank you so much for sending us all these wonderful games. And thank you for watching. Yeah. Thank you for you. Thank you for you. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> and what I would like to know, Ooh. yeah, is what are you giving thanks for? Yeah, that's yeah. a good one. I'll take it in the opposite direction. I want to know what games frustrate you, because a lot of the games we played today were frustrating. Yes, they were. And I'm not thankful for them. No, I am thankful for them. I'm not... Well, you know, <laughs> yeah, we didn't know what we were doing most of the time, but we still had fun. We sure did. Yeah, so thanks for watching, guys, and uh, we'll see you next time. Gobble, gobble! <laughs>